coming to fund based accounting now students in non profit organizations we sometimes receive specific donations for specific purposes they can be like donations for building donations for tournament for match expenses and so on these resources that we receive are credited to specialized funds these funds are not kept idle as such they are actually invested somewhere and these investments are known as investments for specific funds any interest received for these funds is also credited to these funds right so any interest received on these investments is also added to funds it is not taken to be part of your general income let us understand this by taking a few examples how would you deal with the following items while preparing the final accounts of a club the items include prize fund of rupees 80000 the prizes awarded during the year are worth rupees 6000 the prize fund investments are rupees 80000 and the income for prize fund is rupees 8000 so now students we always have to use fund based accounting in this because it is mentioned that we already have a prize fund and all these expenses and incomes would ultimately be adjusted into the prize fund only so prize fund is a liability so prize fund the opening balance is 80000 then we have add income from investments income from investments 8000 that makes it a total of 88 remember any income on investments on account of these funds would actually be added to the fund only during the year we have used this fund to the extent of rupees 6000 so minus prizes awarded 6000 deducted we will have a balance of 82000 in the prize fund for this year then we had investments remember there is no mention of fresh investments made so prize fund investments would appear on the asset side as rupees 80000 there will be no change in the investments as there is no mention of any investment being made during the year